Hello friends, uh, welcome to the tutorial in which we are going to learn on how to use sound effects in Scratch. So in Scratch we can uh, use sound effects in two ways. One is uh, the sound effects that are already available in the Scratch platform. We are going to use that. And another way is uh, we have to download a separate sound effects uh, from a different site and uh, upload it back to the Scratch platform to use it and this video will be useful for those who are searching for how to use sound effects in scratch and another one is uh, those who have followed the squid game tutorial up to here okay now let's start so let's use the sound effect okay i would like to use the sound effect in this battery sprite so i will click this sprite so let me show you where i would like to use the sound effects so if I click in the green flag, so first uh, it's a red light, it's a green light and I will move in the green light and during this process when the batter uh, just uh, flies towards the cat, I would like to use some kind of sound effect here. So let's start. For that uh, we have already clicked in the battery sprite and then we go towards the sound tab like this, click on the sound tab and we only have this sound pop sound if i play it plays like this so i don't want this sound effect i would like to uh, have another sound effect for that let's go to the choose a sound uh, option here click it and you can just uh, look at the bunch of sound effects here and if you just uh, over over the play button so i would like to just search my sound effect M A C H I N E machine. So I like this sound effect. So click this. So the sound effect is available here now. The machine sound. And let's go back to the code tab. And let's go to the sound tab and just uh, drag a start sound block. And uh, just attach it above the glide block like this so when i receive the caught message so when the uh, batter receives the caught message the machine sound starts playing so there are two ways in which we can play sound one is uh, using the start sound block and another one is using the play sound machine until done so there are two ways so for our uh, way we use the start sound machine mm, block because uh, we want the code to flow through other blocks as well during uh, playing of this sound and um, another case is uh, sometimes we want the sound to be played until it's done so if uh, we use this block it will hold the other uh, blocks and place this sound until uh, it's finished and then it goes to the other blocks uh, for our case we want to just uh, start playing the sound and it will just start gliding towards the cat as well and this is how we use sound effects so let's start uh, by just clicking the green flag and see if it works or not so it's a green flag uh, red flag uh, now green flag I'm moving and I will move in the red flag that's the sound effect we want yeah and another sound effect that we want is uh, when the batter sprite hits the cat so there need to be some kind of hitting of sound so let's uh, uh, search for that sound effect also so for that let's go back to the sound stamp and let's search our sound so for hitting sound i'll just search c r u n c h crunch sound this sound looks like hitting, yeah sounds like hitting so the crunch sound is also available now now let's go to the code tab and just uh, drag the start crunch sound block 
uh, above the repeat block like this so it will start the crunch sound here in this block and then uh, it changes the costume inside here so let's see so i click the green flag so it's a red light i don't move green light i'm moving and in the red light i'll move okay that's the sound it doesn't synchronize as um, that well but uh, it's okay in our case okay let's uh, add another sound effect that uh, we want so uh, le let me show you uh, the scenario right now so when I click on the green flag and we are in the green, okay red flag and we want uh, the sound uh, here when uh, the uh, cat is hit with the bat so the cat's body gets splattered here so we want uh, some kind of splattering of sound uh, in this uh, place so let's uh, make that one so for that uh, let's uh, go to the sprites uh, uh, cat uh, sprite click on the cat sprite and let's say uh, use some kind of sound effect uh, for that let's uh, go to the sounds tab and we only have the new sound but we want another sound effect so let's choose the sound effect so I will search for the sound effect called SPLA assets flash so, this sound. so the splash sound is in the area here now so let's go back to the codes tab and then uh, go back to the sounds uh, tab and this uh, drag a start sound splash uh, in the middle of changing of costumes here so when the um, cat sprite ships the caught masses then it starts changing the sprite yeah and in the middle we start the sound splash so let's see what kind of sound effect we get so we'll click on the green flag and it's a red light green light now I will move in the red light as well yeah So that's the sound effect. The splash sound um, just sounds a little bit longer. So let's make it a shorter. So let's uh, edit our sound. For that, let's go to the sound effect uh, sounds uh, tab and click on the splash. So if I play this sound, so it's a little bit longer. Let me make it a little bit shorter. So to make a uh, sound shorter, we can just simply use this. Uh, um, button here the faster button let's just click it so it has uh, decreased a little bit uh, again let's uh, make it more faster and one time again I think uh, it's perfect let me play it again yeah okay let's see if it works or not if I click in the green flag that's a red light green light now I will move in the red light as well okay. yeah perfect sound for the splash and that's how we use the sound effects that are already available in the scratch now uh, let's uh, use the other sound effects uh, that uh, we uh, might uh, uh, be able to use uh, if uh, there are no more sound effects that match our scenario right now so i would like to add uh, music of squid game uh, for that we have uh, we don't have uh, it already available in the uh, sound effects of the scratch so we have to just go to another site so let's go to another site uh, for that we will go to the mindstance.com so here you can search for different kind of sound effects and you can try out uh, your sound effect as well so if I click on this button 
the sound plays right now it's loading that's why it is not playing so let me just oh my god Okay, now let me just uh, search for my sound. S Q U I D Z A M E K. Let's search. So we have got a bunch of sound effects of scratch. Let's see. Okay, this sound. We want this sound as well, and we want another sound as well. I think it's uh, this one. Same sound, yeah. We will be using this sound. Let's see this. Yeah, I want this sound as well. Okay. So, if I click in the name here, so we have uh, been to this space and we can just download the MP3 from here. So for now, I have already downloaded uh, these two uh, uh, sound effects. So let me upload it to our Scratch platform. So we are in the Scratch Scratch platform here. Okay, now let's uh, just upload our sound. Oh, so we are going to be using the those two sound effects. So for that, let me just click on the penguin here. So this is our main character. So we will be using in this penguin character, the other sound effects. And let's uh, start. So we go to the sounds tab. Then we just uh, just over over this icon, choose a sound icon and we just click on the upload sounds. And uh, let's just uh, go to the desktop. So I have already the sound effects uh, downloaded in here and we can download uh, the sounds. So it's Squid Game Tone, open it. So uh, it is the sound effect, so let me play it, yep. this sound and uh, let me upload another sound as well, red light, green light, open it. Yeah, this one so these are the two sound effects that we want to play when the game uh, is uh, started as started so let's go back to the codes tab and let's uh, just play this sound so these two sounds will be just uh, playing in the continuous loop uh, when we start uh, by using uh, by clicking the green flag so let's start uh, let's go to the events tab and drag a win green flag click block and uh, next one is uh, let's go to the controls uh, tab and click on the not click uh, drag a forever loop and let's play the sound uh, for that let's go to the sounds uh, menu and this time we are going to drag the play sound block until done because uh, we want to just uh, play that sound full until it's done and then again repeat again and again so let's just uh, drag this play sound block here inside the forever loop so first uh, let's play the squid game tone and now uh, this code will uh, just uh, play the sound uh, this is squid game tone and if it's completed it will just play it back so uh, let's see what's the effect so if i click on the green flag this is the sound we get And let's uh, just uh, use another sound effect as well that we had downloaded earlier or uploaded earlier. Uh, for using that sound effect, again we do the same thing. We just click in the events block, drag a win green flag click block, go to the controls menu, drag a forever loop. Next one, go to the sounds menu, 
play this uh, drag a play sound uh, block inside a horrible loop and this time we are going to play the red light green light as well and that's it let's uh, see I click on the green flag and the sound is red light and this is how we use sound effects okay thank you so much uh, guys for watching this tutorial and if you like this tutorial don't forget to like also comment and subscribe as well and see you in the next video